Hello everyone, this is Anjali Wahingbom and you're watching Imoenu Live Top 20 News. Rail operation between Assam and Mizoram has resumed the services between Silchar and Vairabi. Pre-medical camp held at Vaitol village by 37 Assam rifles and distributed medicines today. Assam Chief Minister Himanta Vishwa Sarma visited Nimatigat today to ensure the steps taken by the Inland Water Transport Department of Jorhat and Majuli. 15th Foundation Day of Manipur State Commission for Women held at Classic Grande, Imphal. The Government of Assam released a notification today regarding TET 2021. The last day to submit the online application is September 25. Assam Government released Standard Operating Procedure for Durga Puja today. Three northeastern states meet target for capital expenditure in Q1 of current financial year. The famous tourist destination and UNESCO World Heritage Site, Kangsenzongpa National Park in West Sikkim is now open for tourists. The Surge Battalion of 23 Sector Assam Rifles under the aegis of Headquarter Eager East conducted a mini-marathon today. West Bengal government extended the COVID-19 restrictions till September 30 with the existing relaxations. Prime Minister Narendra Modi launched Sangsat TV today, which is an important chapter in the parliamentary system. Delhi government banned sale, use and storage of firecrackers this Diwali. PM Modi paid homage to M. Visveswaraya on his 168th birth anniversary as engineer day today. Underwater tunnel, BGP Marine Kingdom becomes India's first ever and the largest walk-through aquarium. Chief of Defence Staff General Bipin Rawat said today that the situation in Afghanistan is still evolving and more trouble was expected. India participated in SEO peaceful mission military exercise in Russia. The Indian Coast Guard today apprehended a Pakistani boat with 12 crew members of Gujarat Coast during surveillance. Table tennis star Manika Batra left out of Indian squad which will be featuring at the Asian Championship. Lasith Malinga announced his retirement from all formats of the game. And today's Assam COVID update, total positive cases 444, recovery rate is 98.13% and total death is 8. That's the end of Top 20 News. Thank you for watching. That's the end of Top 20 News. Thank you for watching.